Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're talking about Shamil Gaziv versus Martin Boudet. Shamil Gaziv, 11-0, plus 155 underdog, 33 years old, 6'4", with a 78 inch reach. Fighting Martin Boudet, who's 13-1. He's a minus 185 favorite, which is pretty good. 32 uh, years old, 6'4", with a 77-inch reach, inch and a half inch reach advantage for Shamil. This is a very interesting matchup because you have Shamil, who did not look great and his contender series fight his iq was weird um his, his gas tank didn't look uh, great to me personally uh, but boudet we know what boudet is he's he's good if he can get in close he'll keep the fight there he's very strong striking doesn't look bad that is probably where some openings are at but again in submissions, of course, jo uh, 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 Martin Boudet is very good with, you know, submitted Josh Parisian. It is Josh Parisian, but still submitted him. Beat uh, Jake Collier by decision. Just kept the fight super close to Jake. And then fought Lucas Brzezinski. I thought some people, I think some people thought Brzezinski won that fight. I didn't think so at all. I didn't think Brzezinski looked great. I didn't think either one of these guys looked great. I didn't think Brzezinski had won that fight. But... It, it's just my opinion. It is what it is. And then he beat Chris Barnett. He just stayed super close to him. Didn't let him explode at all. I expect the first round to be very, very tough for Martin Boudet. But I have Boudet winning this. I, I think he wins the second, the third round. I think he smothers Shamil. I think he keeps it super close. Maybe gets a couple of takedowns here and there. Look for some, some submissions. I like at minus 185 favorite. I like submission or decision for Martin Boudet. As always, let me know what you guys are picking. Let me know what you guys are thinking. I know some people that are high on Shamil. Let me know why. As always, subscribe, like, comment. Peace.